Dead PS Plays. It's a let's play. Am I doing it right? Yeah, this is... Seems like they were, like, predicting the future with the... <laughs> With the future of, of what a lot of Wii games would be with this game. It's like they knew that it would, um, you know. This is a strong example of a third party game. Doing the, you know. Okay. Um. But yeah, this is like a, a big a big example of like, you know. If the game was mediocre, at least it would be more, you know. So yeah, you only have to complete three to get in there, but I'm going to try to go ahead and complete this one as well. Unless there's a mini game that I just absolutely cannot beat, I'm going to try to do them all. Alright. I think I get it. Hopefully YouTube won't copyright me on this. <coughs> Dancing! I'm so tired of all these stupid, like, these things turns like kids' cartoons that was like dancing at the end of everything. Let's do this stupid dancing for everything. It's not even good dancing. It's just, you know. These do actually get a little harder. So yeah, this game was actually originally going to be a, uh, a Wii exclusive. But... They decided to go with like... Uh, also on 360, PS2... Stuff like that. I think it was also going to be on the DS as well, but mainly it was just going to be a Wii exclusive. But by, you know, by the way this game is set up, you can definitely tell it was more meant for the shoot. Oh, of course. I have it right by the mic. <laughs> Good enough, right? That's cool. Oh yeah, you can control this with the D-pad. Or whatever pad you call it on the Wiimote. Interesting. Alright, let's see.
I think I know what this one is. Yeah. These are on rail shooters. Headshot. <laughs> I don't know how this one didn't get an E10 rating. I mean, I know it's not like the most violent thing ever, but like something about it just kind of feels more like a E10 rating, like the others. Probably not gonna get everything to you know what they want, but. <laughs> Honestly, just the way they sound is really funny. I know a lot of people say they're annoying. If you hear it too much, it can get annoying, but like, it's really not that annoying. Ah, shoot. I was gonna say, it's one of those broken ones. <laughs> Superman. Super Bunny. I mean, I guess if these were more bullets and stuff than, uh, than plungers, or something a little more violent, I guess, what's, what's considered violent. I guess it would get an E10 rating, but, you know. One thing I need to play again is, uh... Is, um... Ra uh... Ravage Rumble. It wasn't that great, from what I can remember, but I need to give it another shot. But I swear, it's almost impossible to find these days. Let's see. Like, after Rayman left, it did kind of go downhill. Like, Rabbits Go Home was alright. But, uh, you know. Um. But yeah, after, after Rabbids... It's more like after Rabbids Go Home, the series kind of went downhill. I mean, Raving Rabbids Travel in Time was alright, but, you know. Overall, the series kind of went meh. Not that the series was all that great to begin with, but I still enjoy it. Yay! Toop. So much me. You're a little of plunder. Hunt toilets. But, but, what's this? Oh, 
poop. Let's see. Whoa, you can mess with music on here. But I'm not gonna do that right now. <laughs> I think your bed either saves the game or no, it doesn't. Okay, you can change costumes right here. I can make. <coughs> I can't do it. I can't. I can't. I can't do the voice. I was gonna try to do Marge. Why don't we just be old granny, why don't we? You know. Well he's done why don't she why don't she be black Rayman? <laughs> well anyway. I guess for this next round we can be uh we'll just be granny. For the next round. I'm ready. So yeah, the first first few parts of this game, you you know, you do this, you are treated like a prisoner, forced into these games. It's a little repetitive to keep seeing that, but you know. Look at me, I'm Granny Reman. <sighs> Granny Ramen. Oh yeah. Again? I should pay attention. Alright, let's see. Sh okay, shake the nunchuck. Alright. Uh, a bit unnecessary, but okay. 